Hey Collective, how are y'all doing today? Phoenix Angel 888 coming to you with another reading. This is going to be a collective reading. Please, please, please take what resonates, leave the rest. Do not make the story fit if it does not fit for you. Okay, um, so I was urged to, uh, to do a reading, but I was watching Brown Sugar, okay? I've never seen this movie before. I honestly, honestly, I got it mixed up with uh what is that? Love and Basketball. Uh <laughs> Yeah, I don't watch I don't watch movies like that, okay? Um but they was at the scene where they was at the park and oh boy, um their best friends, it's a boy and a girl, but oh boy left the recording company that he worked for and so he wanted to start his own but he was talking to his best friend the chick and so she ended up investing in him to start his own uh recording studio stuff like that okay so I got that but I could tell like it was a, a love friend vibe there just underhandedly um but then it went on to commercial and then they got the new Fruit Loop commercial, you know, where the the bird is sitting there with, I don't know what the heck that thing is. I don't, I don't forgot what, um, and he does the woo hoo 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 or foo foo hoo hoo or something like that. And then all the Fruit Loops fall on the piano, but then he takes a spoon and he tries to eat out of the piano and the piano falls. I don't know if, I don't know if I'm getting the download about the fall of the, the Hollywood and everything going on with Diddy and all that other stuff where the mu music industries are falling at this point. Okay. Um, but yeah, anyways, so there is a little birdie um in the in the music industry that that is like I, I feel like there's at least three birdies that are like in people's ears about certain things or like confirming things behind the scenes for the government okay I, I don't know about that that's that's what I'm getting the feeling um but then like I started getting really like I don't know. I was like, I, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I asked the divine. I was like, show me what, what the heck? Like, cause they, they told me to do a reading. I need to get online, and do a reading. So I'm like, okay, well, what, what, what are you trying to tell me? What are you trying to show me? Like, and then I started getting like real emotional, like a missing, like, you know how you ain't seen your best friend for a while and then y'all start missing each other and then it's like y'all calling each other back in? Like, that's the feeling that I was getting. Like, really remorseful and stuff like that. And then they was like, no, you need to do a pre-shuffle. Because I was just going to come on here and just go ahead and, you know, just start like I normally do. But they was like, no, get a pre-shuffle. Man, when I tell you this shit went left field completely. <laughs> this shit went left field. But it still feels like there's, like, I don't know. Like, sorry, y'all. 343 on the clock. We gonna look that number up as well. But let's actually look that number up right now because I, I'll be forgetting. So, let's see. 343. 343. Trust in the connections you feel within you. Certain guides are communicating to and through you. Okay. <coughs> Is somebody messing with my throat? Like, I don't think they, and I'm hot. Like, I'm really, let me, hold on. Hold on, y'all. It's, it's really hot in here. Okay, so. Oh, I got to turn on my fan. Oh, my shoe just came off. Okay, it was not hot in here until I started on here. And that's crazy, too, because there's fire on that fucking thing. Maybe they're trying to tell me I need to light my candle. <laughs> Anyways, y'all, okay. Mm. Okay, I hope y'all are doing well. 
I'm so sorry, y'all. This this has me a little like thrown completely off because I'm like this this never I never I don't really get guided to to do a pre shuffle. And then it's like the energy that I'm feeling and then when I do the pre shuffle, it's like it, it's totally five one five on the clock. It's totally freaking different. Like the energy it's still lingering here. But then the cards don't match with the energy. So I don't okay, so somebody could be it could be like mixed mix signals type stuff. Um anyways, we we going to get started, okay? Let's let's kind of clear out this cuz it, it was a lot, okay? Uh this, this is a lot. <laughs> I didn't even get to finish brown sugar like and I've never watched it. I'm going to have to look it up and see where I could watch it at. Because it's on BET right now. They having their little uh, love marathon thing on BET right now. So, Ooh, okay. All right. Okay, so... Now that we got that all squared away, okay. Now, <laughs> yo, 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 yo. Okay, I hope everyone is doing well. Today is Sunday, 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 Sunday. I hope y'all are doing well. I really appreciate everyone, each and every one of you, for coming down here and spending time with me on this beautiful Sunday afternoon. Well, evening, actually. It ain't too sunny where I'm at. It, it's like it wants the whole bag raining. It's been it's been on and off like um uh, sprinkling, but it hasn't had that real downpour yet. Um and I don't want to tell it to rain like when it cuz usually when I say when it rains it pours, it's going like within 20 minutes it's going to start pouring. So hopefully we get lucky this time. <laughs> they did not hear me. <laughs> Anyways, okay, so something could have happened on May 21st, um, or May 21st could be significant um, in this. Somebody could be 21, um, or uh, this could have been happening, I'm hearing ages between ages 5 and 21, okay? Let's, okay, they're saying start up here. Okay, so it says it's time to, it's time to pay up, karmics repay all. And then I got pull two cards with book to pull two oracle cards with book, which are right here. And then bitch be gone spray or be be gone spray. OK. So from the remorse and the feeling and the emotions that I got and then when they had me pull from the bag, like it didn't fit because when when I saw it, when I finally pulled out these three cards and I laid them all out, I'm like, what the heck? This don't even match the energy. So I think it's like, I don't know if it's the karmics that feel in remorse or if it's your person that feels in remorse. I'm not sure. Or maybe your, your person like jumped on the karmic bandwagon and then like is now wanting to, to switch and and they feel remorse i'm not sure but it says 21 it says clover release your guilt okay so you may be feeling guilty in a situation um or you need to release some guilt or this is your person needing to release some some guilt um but there is guilt in a situation on some things um they could be conversing um like with other people or with friends that see them as okay sign of synchronicity okay so somebody is conversing and talking with their friends about the situation okay this could be over a fire or um well hell we talking right now <laughs> and we got fire lit so i mean you never know i don't know um but outside nature um you see they're they're showing sign of synchronicity okay but you see how their face are looking like it's shock. Like they're both in shock right now. So somebody could be in shock at um, like you releasing things or you you no longer feeling guilty for whatever happened is what I'm hearing. OK, I, I'm, I'm not sure. And then we got five. Um, 
so these could be i don't know why they're telling me mixed races okay so there's mixed races involved so we got white here look like japanese and then we got black so it could be different races that um that came together because we got this it's time to pay up karmic karmic's got to repay all so um but it has stars on here so you could have made a wish it says you can manifest your every wish so there is a wish that you manifested that is about to come true um, but there needs to be some guilt that needs to be released first. Okay. All right. Whew, that was a lot. Okay. So we going to, do y'all want these right here? I don't think y'all do. They said no. Okay. So I'm not going to do that. Okay. Okay. So we going to clarify these with my deck and we going to see what is this? What does the karmics need to repay or what did they do? um that is causing them to have to repay we're gonna dive a little bit into it okay oh and then the bottom of the deck over here was gold you don't need someone else to fix you okay so it looks like you're focusing on fixing yourself uh seashells could be significant um the color black the color green could be significant um blue can be significant you could be dealing with somebody who has long blonde hair um somebody who wears glasses who likes sign of synchronicities i'm hearing um antiques or like those little um tentrics tentrics the little like figurine things or like they little things that they can you know design things or like um display around their house okay uh, i'm not i'm not sure somebody deals with that 36 could be significant march 6 could be significant february 1st could be significant february 5th february 21st um may 21st uh january 2nd january 5th january 3rd january 6th um january 21st could be significant as well um january 5th i think i already said that anyways okay all right, so let's go ahead and see. So celebrities could be involved. Look, didn't we just say something about the file with the with the new Fruit Loop commercial thing? Okay, well, yeah, they got to pay. So them karmics, them karmic celebrities that's been doing things behind the whole nation's back. Look, look, I'm not going to motherfucking lie. Did you see that? Look. 100% truth ace card. So this is the divine speaking that them motherfucking celebrities have to pay for everything. Everything. I have a feeling people are going to stop buying, like, listening to people's music. There was, there was this one, um, there was this one reader that I watched yesterday while I was door dashing. And she, um... She got um, some messages from the uh, Jungle Book song, um, I Want to Be Like You. But then when she read it, it like the the lyrics was like all messed up. Like, I, I don't even want to like <laughs> repeat the lyrics. But if y'all know, y'all know, go go do your research. OK, uh, yeah, go go do your research when it when it comes to that that song because like it it didn't seem right for it to be in a kid's movie like this honestly and then it says i cry at night because i know you're gone for good celebrities so a lot of celebrities could be crying at this time it's 100 percent truth yeah karma's are gonna have to pay so somebody is there is a celebrity that you are connected to that cries at night because they know you're gone for good um, they could be the ones that are feeling remorse at this time because they let the karmics come in the way. And they, they feel guilty and they're trying to release it because you, they could have made a wish and you could have came into their life. But at that time, they didn't understand why you came into, your, into their life or them, or you could be the celebrity and, you prayed and then somebody came into your life and then you you know you you let the karmics get in the way yeah and this could be you <laughs> being right in the middle bitch be gone spray like this could be you or 
I'm getting that there could also be like the karmics, um, like your person may be telling the karmics, like, bitch, be gone. Like, I don't, I don't want you because my person, I'm over here crying all night because I know that this motherfucker is gone for good. Like, <laughs> it could be something like that. Okay, collective, take it how it resonates, leave the rest. But we gonna put that look Hebrew. So somebody could be a Hebrew Israelite. That's what I'm getting. And then this one to fall at two. So I guess whatever is falling, they tell me whatever falls, just just put it on. Put it on the table. Okay. So we gon' okay, so Holy Spirit, what what do you have for these karmics? It's time to pay. What, what's going on with this situation here? We got a Hebrew. FBI just released witnesses. So a divine masculine. I just read a notification that that came on my on this phone that I'm that I have right here. Um, I'm also feeling that a divine masculine thought you were the evil one, or that like you put something on them, but in reality it wasn't you. It was their mother or father that did this. Or there is a, a mother or father who was not uh, protected by the evil eye. Or is no longer wanting to send you evil eye energy. Yeah, yeah. You see how that wanted to come out. <clears throat> they said do not take any reversals. So I'm not taking no reversals. They judged you. <clears throat> they judged you. Yeah, you see how I wanted to, um, how I had to clear my throat on that? Yeah, they could have judged you and said that you wasn't protected, but in reality you are. Yep, look, they judged you at the bottom of the deck. So people are no longer judging you. They're in remorse because they know what they did deep down and they have to pay for it. Whether it's physical, spiritual. What's up with this situation for the collective? Yeah, get in your CEO mindset. So you could have did this. Yeah, the the most high will show you who your who is the enemy. Okay. So the the divine could be showing you the most high is showing you right now who is your enemy. Okay. And if he's not showing you yet, you know, ask for confirmation. Give him a specific thing to show you um for confirmation of who these people are. Oh, excuse me. Get in your CEO mindset. So you need to focus on yourself at this time. Um, you could have manifested something when it comes to your career. And it's starting to like blossom. It's starting to take off. Like you're focusing more on that. Um, they want you to keep at it. They don't want you to quit. Okay. I'm trying to get. We just going to put that right there. Okay. <laughs> Cause I don't want to cover any cards, but I feel like they ju they just gonna get covered as well. Look at that child sex trafficking. Mm. Yeah, it's time to pay for them. President. Oh, okay. So the president was involved. The president allowed it to happen, or something's going on with the president. Or there is a president of something. It doesn't have to be like the actual president of the United States. Um, it could be a CEO. What's up with this president? What, what's going on with the president right now? Ooh, don't drink what they make you. Okay, so the president needs to watch his back. Yeah, give the divine a chance. Don't drink what they make you. Okay, so this president could be on the wrong side of his energy. I'm also getting to, okay, so you know how somebody like with the, with the, um, how the, the guy on, um, brown sugar, he's starting his own, um, he's starting his own recording studio. Okay, well, if you and your CEO mindset, and you're starting, you know, to venture out and be an entrepreneur and stuff like that. You are the president of whatever you are creating. So the divine wants you to give them, wants you to give them a chance.
because they're going to help you. And they're also going to block the people that are karmics to you because they have to pet. Okay, so whatever they did, you're about to get 10, you're about to get 10 times fold is what I just heard. Okay, yeah. It's time to pay up. Karmics repay all. Bitch be gone spray. This is what your ancestors are telling the karmics. Okay, 100% truth, ace card. Give the divine a chance. Okay, because you are about to be a president of whatever you are about to put your mindset into. But don't drink what they make you because they're going to try to sabotage is what I'm hearing. All of this, okay? You let go of the guilt of whatever you did in your past and you just, you're continuing to move forward. And the divine is about to answer your wish. Okay, and these people are crying at night because they know you're gone for good. Okay, okay, there we go. Yep, the most high will show you who your enemy is. Okay, thank you, spirit. Thank you. Yep, your best friend could be significant as well. Um, so your best friend's mother did something. She's in reverse. Stay hydrated. Okay, so she, she may be trying to block things from you. A Latin man or woman. Your best friend's mother. Something's about to happen to a best friend's mother. Stay hydrated. Okay, so a Latin man or woman needs to stay hydrated. Yeah, they are coming back to explain everything. Okay, so you need to work an earth sign is in reverse. Oop, well, we're not taking anything in reverses. Okay, so that's the side note for somebody, okay? All right, so what else do we have in this situation? What else? We got mother or father, okay? This mother, this mother or father sees you um, in this energy. Or this mother or father is going to have to repay. Your mother or father or a mother or father is crying at night because they did you wrong. And they don't know how to repay you back. Or your mother and father, um, you need to watch what they... Yeah, don't drink what they make you. So they're... Okay, so they're secret something. Okay. Yeah, look, an arranged marriage. Okay, so... That's kind of crazy. Yeah, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you a little story. Okay, we're going to do story time. Okay. All right. So my stepfather, who recently passed away, um, he arranged a marriage for me when I was... I, I think I think he said I don't know it was the year it was the year that I moved in it's the year that he moved my mother and her children into his house um so I want to say I was about like 17 18 when there was an arranged marriage Okay, fucked up thing is, okay, so my stepfather arranged a marriage for me and my mother arranged a marriage for me to a whole different person. Like, it was not the same. Two different men, okay? So, one does not have a contract with anyone else. And then the other one has two other contracts with two other women. Um... Yeah, so that could be significant. They don't want me to go any further than that. But, yeah, arranged marriage is out here. So the divine is speaking to me as well, just like they're speaking to you, okay? So so this could be an arranged marriage that's that's about to go on. Or, they're, or the, the divine is trying to figure out this. Yeah, they never wanted to see you happy. So they tried to do it with karmics. Just breathe, okay. You just gonna breathe at this point because it, it looks like it's gonna get complicated. 
I don't know why they wanted me to break it down, but that's how I heard it. Okay, what's going on with this mother or father? I'm here. I'm also hearing too that okay. So your your ancestors in the ethers they are having meetings. So yesterday we got the meetings. Um. So if you have not watched my reading, I posted it today, but I did it yesterday. Um, I forgot to to post it because I had to jump on and and work. Um. But the ancestors are having meetings with um, your divine masculines for their contracts, okay, in the ethers. So their ancestors, so your your masculine's ancestors, look, we have more than one, okay? <clears throat> they don't want me to get this message out. Okay, so everyone has more than one masculine, okay? Well, your ancestors are having meetings with their ancestors, Okay, but in order for these masculines to come back into your life, if they did something wrong or if they stringed you along or, or play with you or did anything and try to keep you, you know, bound while they deal with these fucking karmics and shit like that, they have to go to their ancestors. And their ancestors have to speak to your ancestors on their behalf just to be able to even come near you now. So there is it's a lot. I feel like it's a lot more to it. I'm hearing you just don't know. <clears throat> okay, so that could be significant as well. Okay. Oh my God, they are messing with my throat chakra today. Yeah, death spells, evil eye voodoo hoodoo and uh, voodoo dolls. Okay, so somebody could have a voodoo doll on you. It could be a mother or a father. Um, this could be your mother or father, or this could be somebody else's mother or father. What's what's up with this mother or father? Yeah, look, they have you fucked up, your ancestor said. Okay, so they have you fucked up. These karmas are definitely going to have to pay because they have you fucked up. Or your mother, or your mother and father have you fucked up. Yeah, you healed your inner child. So... I'm hearing you saved the day when it come, when it came to your ancestors. So something could have been like at the last minute, they know they made a mistake. Okay, so yes, these karmics know that they made a mistake. Your, your mother and father could also be karmics. Okay. Yep, turn your knowledge into cash. So whatever you are about to venture out onto... With your CEO mindset and you about to be the president of it, the divine is walking you through and guiding you on what you need to do, okay? Don't don't worry about, yeah, reveal hidden rewards and get paid out instantly, okay? So you about to start getting paid out instantly. Like yesterday um, when I was dashing, I went to Taco Bell just to get me a drink. Um, but it's the normal Taco Bell that I go to, you know, to get the orders and stuff like that. And he didn't give me a price. And it's not a normal person that, like, I see, you know, on, on a night, on a nightly. So, um, but when I got up there, I was like, how much? And he was like, no, nah, baby, it's for free. And I'm just like, what? Like, are you trying to hit on me? He was like, no. He was like, it was just, it was just put on my heart just to give it to you for free. And I was like, oh, well, bless you. Thank you. Like, I appreciate that. Like, that's the type of things that you are about to be um, experiencing. Like, you're about to start, yeah. <laughs> you might even go to the grocery store and the person in front of you or the person behind you is going to pay for your stuff. I don't know why I'm getting that too. Um, but like, things like that to where you're not going to have to, people are going to be giving to you instead of you always giving it out. Your cup is never going to be dry again is what I'm hearing. Okay. So congratulations, <laughs> collective. Congratulations. Yeah, I failed. I tried and failed. Divine Feminine wins. So you you, you won this situation because you passed the test for your ancestors. This is Okay, so this is the part. I'm hearing this is the part where they could not finish. They couldn't finish this part of where you're about to elevate from. 
they couldn't finish this part before they left Earth or before they left for home is what I'm hearing. Okay. So you understood the assignment better than your ancestors did because they chose not to. Um, I'm hearing see it through. Okay. So they could have got distracted, you know, with karmics or dealing with other things, you know, life be life in, we all know, but you chose to stay on the path. You gave the divine a chance and now you're about to see it through. Sign of synchronicity. Thank you, spirit. 30, 30 when I look down. So you could be the age of 30. We got retest the blood sample. Okay. And then it says, enemies are around you. And red could be significant. Crazy thing is, you see all this black around here, and then we got one red card, and it says, bitch be gone spray. That's your ancestors. <laughs> but then when they're saying retest the blood sample, I'm, I'm, feeling, I'm feeling that that is like your, your... So when I did this, when I made this card, um, I got like when you ascend so much, um, like your DNA starts to change and stuff like that. So you may not have the same DNA as your mother and father anymore because you've ascended to a higher level and to a higher frequency. Okay, so we got enemies are around you. So you know how to move with these enemies now? Yeah, return to sender times 10 love yourself so the more that you love yourself and do your self-care and everything like that and be in that ceo mindset and worry about yourself you're not even gonna have to return anything to sender because it's already your energy does it on its own yeah you left them speechless yeah so you're leaving people speechless right now okay what is this enemies are around you we got undercover cops. Okay, so there could be some undercover cops that are watching you at this time. You know who this is. Okay, so collective, you know exactly who this undercover cop is um, or these enemies that are around you. Yes, you were on point confirmation. Okay. So, yeah, collective, there are some undercover cops around you. Um, I'm here in neighborhood. Like, everyone's watching you. It was so freaking weird yesterday. So, I I went to a couple places. Um, after I did the first reading, um, my energy was, like, really, really high. Like, I was, I was happy. I was joyful. But I could tell that I was on a different frequency than everyone else in the store. Because I had just random people, like, watching me and following me down different... Um, different aisles and stuff like that it was really weird it's like they wanted to get close to me but they couldn't get so they could only get so close before they like had to like stop and like turn around so things like that could be happening to you as well um but undercover cop or cop so somebody was trying to be undercover or giving information to um to the cops so you could have a snake in your camp and they was trying to feed the cops information to get you um arrested you know um i'm hearing terminated so they could somebody could have tried to pay an undercover cop to like off your ass <sighs> what the fuck is this <laughs> What is this, spirit? What is this? They said, get your other deck. Uh -huh, okay. Uh-uh. Close my door and and turn around and knock. Yes. May I have a pop? You can have half of a pop. Okay. Sorry about that, y'all. Okay. All right, so let's let's see what this is. We got vampires, lights, light candles for your ancestors. So these could be vampires. Um, you see how this don't even want to go. Like, so if you know a vampire, this this vampire could be an undercover cop, or like deal with some. So an earth sign. Yeah, I knew, I knew. 
Mm. Red is also with the root chakra. They wanted me to alliterate that. So we got an earth sign back out on the bottom of the deck. So you could have known that this, this earth sign was an undercover cop. Or this could be um, somebody is dealing with um, an earth sign. And they have an undercover cop in their camp. I'm also getting that as well. Your energy is too powerful. Still speak though. They didn't want you to speak. Okay, what is going on with this undercover cop? I'm also getting to your your mother or father could have been an undercover cop. 444, ancestors are with you. Have faith, your prayers are being heard loud and clear, okay? So you are protected from this undercover cop. Or these people playing like they're undercover cops is what I'm hearing. They could try to like put on a fake uniform. You know, it is about to be halloween too so pay attention to that as well as people dressing up as fucking um cops and shit like that and trying to flash their badge make sure you get their badge number in they in their name and everything like that and record the situation is what i'm hearing don't forget to fucking record yeah you did it divine feminine on top of the world <sighs> too much what's what's up with this yeah they're hating from afar Okay, so these undercover cops are hating from afar because you, you know exactly what they, they did. Or there could be an undercover cop that is about to get in trouble for a murder is what I'm hearing as well. And they need to retest the blood sample. Or they tried to retest the blood sample and it was not the same blood sample that they that they tested. Somebody, okay, so there's an undercover cop that is about to get um, arrested for this blood sample. I'm getting that as well. You defeated them. Okay, I'm also getting to somebody took... Okay, so with this undercover cop and this blood sample, I'm also getting to that the undercover cop is the one that emmed, murdered off the person... But then the undercover cop was not charged for the M. The blood sample that they tested was by someone who they planted evidence on to get arrested for the M. Do you follow me? If you follow me, <laughs> put in the comments and put three Okay, no, actually put 444 in the comments. Okay, if you're, if you, if you following me at this point, okay. So there was an undercover cop, okay, that off somebody. Okay, and they planted, it could be on a mother or father. So an undercover cop planted something on somebody's mother or father. So they could get arrested for an M that they committed. The murder samples, the, the murder samples. So the blood doesn't match in the murder samples. What the hell did I just tap into? <sighs> Somebody also could be trying to pin you for a murder or an undercover cop is about to retest okay I'm also getting to if somebody had to go to the hospital and get like a blood transfusion too they're going to find out that their, their child is not their child it's going to be somebody else's child that's what I'm hearing as well this is why they're going to have to pay something back because your child was stolen from you is what I'm hearing by these people. Mm. Fraud evidence. They could be knowing this. That's why they cry because they're guilty. I'm also picking that up too. That, that is something... What is this? Someone is undercover. Look, we got undercover cop and someone is undercover. Please have faith in me. Okay, so someone is undercover trying to watch 
Yeah, your purpose is not the same as your earth family. Okay, so this undercover cop. Okay, okay. One's good, one's bad. This undercover cop was sent to watch you, to protect you. So this undercover cop knows some shit. So there's one undercover cop that is a good guy. There's one undercover cop that is a bad guy. That's why it has cop and then s. Okay. So there's two undercover cops. Sign of synchronicity. One was sent to protect you. You know exactly who this person is. From the, It could be from an earth sign. Or the earth sign. It could be the undercover cop. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay. Now we're getting into something. Yep. Listen to your intuition. Okay. They hate you but love you at the same time. So these people are frauds. They, <sighs> it could be your earth family that are doing all of this shit. I wouldn't be surprised. And you picked up on this shit a long time ago. No. So it could be, it could not be your earth sign. But it's in reverse. So no means yes and yes means no. We're going to see if it pops out. Okay, what's up with this? Your earth family is not feathers. Okay. So feathers is connected to the divine. It's also connected to an indigenous tribe as well. The Native Americans pay attention to the red flags. Um, yeah, so pay attention when it comes to your earth family as well. You could be getting um, getting messages from feathers or you need to pay attention to your thoughts when you see a feather, okay? Or your ancestors are sending you feathers, um, sign of synchronicity, my dog is barking, um, to give you messages, okay? So make sure you're paying attention to that. Make sure you're paying attention to red flags. There could be an undercover cop following you as well is what I'm hearing. Yeah, meditate to gain clarity, okay, about the situation. Because I feel like there's a lot of scenarios and a lot of things that are going on in this situation. But I don't feel like it's not coming to your door just yet. You'll get some type of information about this. Or you may, the divine is going to give you the information. They don't. They won't give it to us all at once. He'll only give it to us in bits and pieces because if he gives us the movie, I'm hearing the movie all at once, then we can like back out of it. Like we may back out of it. So we're getting details of it in bits and pieces. But you are protected collective. Okay. So pay attention to this. Yep. Divinely protected right here. Yep. And the wish fulfillment feels like a nightmare for these people. So whoever these karmics are. I feel like they in reverse. Yeah. <laughs> you know who this is. See, look, we got two cards that came out. Look, you know who this is. You know who this is. Double confirmation right there. You know, collective, you know exactly who this is, who I'm talking about and who these people are. Okay. They could have tried to give information to the cops about you and everything is backfiring on them. <laughs> Mm. what else there who is this person look somebody who has control issues so they could have wanted to control your life and control everything green could be significant as well green is represented with the heart chakra as well um so they could be trying to block your heart chakra or they don't want you operating in your heart chakra It says they are blocked from your energy. Okay, so your ancestors are blocking the people that like know they did they know they did you wrong. A water sign could be significant. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Yeah, you're untouchable. And then we got pay attention to the red flags. Okay, so pay attention to the red flags when it comes to this water sign. I'm hearing this person just ain't right. Okay, so that could be, okay, so somebody could sign a synchronicity. I got a notification on this phone. Um, I wonder if y'all could hear it. I don't know. <laughs> I just saw 44. Um, you deserve love. Okay, so this water sign could have tried to set you up for like a, a, a or, or this, okay, one could have set you up for a murder. 
and two, this person is involved in in taking something from you. It could be your child or it could just be on the fact that they ruin your life. Like they got control issues. They they wanted to control something and now they are fucking up. They can't. Or your mother and father could have been a water sign. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Take it how it resonates, okay? Blues, clues, energy. So they could be trying to work on, like, finding somebody to, like, um, yeah. Sign of synchronicity. I will fight for this divine feminine. Okay, so somebody is about to come clean or has gotten some information On the reason why you're so untouchable. What's the bottom of the day? Why did you ghost me, Divine Feminine? So you could not be talking to this water sign. Or what's that other sign that came out? Uh, earth sign, I believe. The earth sign fall out. So it could be an earth sign and a water sign involved. Use your head, mini me. So... They could have thought you were, like, naive and stuff. Like, you wasn't going to catch on or anything like that. But you ended up paying attention to the red flag. Yeah. A single mother could be significant. Or you could be the single mother as well. Where is my... Uh, let's get the Kipper deck. Let's see what's going on with this. So, you might get an alert about this as well. I just saw my phone alert. Okay. What is going on about this situation, Spirit? Look, they don't... <laughs> to be collected. Okay, so they wanted you to be collected. All cash will arrive for customer... What? I don't even know. I can't even stop it. Uh, I'm also getting two because they showed me um, the main female poisoning woman. So there could have been a main female that tried to poison you. Okay, what's going on in this situation, spirit? Tell us more. I want this one. We got privileged lady. Okay, so here you are collected. Number 12 could be significant. January 2nd. January 12th could be significant. What's up with this privileged lady? Imprisonment. Poverty and message. Okay. So they wanted you to be in prison and in poverty. Or there is a privileged lady that is about to get a message about somebody that's about to go to jail or be in poverty. What's going on with this privileged lady, spirit? What's going on with this privileged lady? What do they want to happen to the privileged lady? There we go. What did they want to happen to this privileged lady? Message of concern. So December 14th could be significant. Um, January 12, 14 could be significant. 12, 14. Okay. Uh, the numbers are adding up. Okay. Three, five. So March 5th can be significant, January 1st, January 4th, January 12th, January 14th. Then you got February 1st, February 12th, February 14th, February 2nd. Okay, then you got December 1st, December 4th, December 12th, December 14th could be significant. Then you got... April 1st, April 2nd, April 12th, April 14th, April 4th. 
Okay, what is this privileged lady message of concern? Message. So seven, okay, so July 12th, July 14th, July 1st, July 2nd, July 4th could be significant. Okay. And then we got sudden wealth. Okay, so this privileged lady is about to get a message about sudden wealth. You may have multiple messages coming on because we got message of concern and then we got message here. Message. That's that's what I'm hearing. And then I'm also hearing what is that? Uh that one song from that um You just got a letter. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. I wonder who it'd be. That. From Blue's Clues. I think we just had Blue's Clues energy out here as well. I'm hearing pocket watching. Or a pocket watch somebody could write. Cash in check daily. That could be significant for somebody or you may end up getting like checks just randomly out the mail of like people trying to pay you back what they owe you. Okay, what is this privileged lady message or concern message? Of unexpected income from a thief. And pathway. Okay, so you're about to get unexpected money from a thief. Or you're about to get a message about this thief trying to take unexpected money from you. They took the wrong path. Seven two seven could be significant. February twenty seventh, July twenty seventh, July fourteenth, July twelfth, July twenty fourth, July third, July fifth, March fifth, February February fourth, February third, February fifth. Somebody, okay, so there is a thief that took the wrong pathway to gain this sudden wealth and this unexpected money, or this unexpected income. That's why it says they have to all pay it back. The karmics have to pay back. Okay, what is this thief here in this pathway? What is this thief here in this pathway? Ooh. Let's see what they have. We got high honor, lovers, expectation, gift, mature woman, courthouse, and community. Okay. So this mature woman went to the courthouse to take away this gift in this lover situation. Somebody was not right in a situation is what I'm hearing. I'm hearing, why did you do that? Like, why? She didn't break my heart. That's, that's what I'm hearing. Somebody is questioning somebody. It could be somebody is questioning a mother or a father on why they did something. What is this thief in this pathway? What is this thief in this pathway? Thank you, Holy Spirit. We got lovers. So a lover is a thief? Or somebody tried to take something from these from this lover? Yes, baby. No, I'm not, baby. Four, four, four on the clock. Um, this, so we got December 12th, 
December 15th, December 7th, December 27th, December 14th. Um, we got uh, February 4th. Okay, February 15th, February 5th. I'm saying one, two, three, four, five. That could be significant. Somebody could be seeing 14, 24, 12, 24, 12, 15. These dates could be significant to you or these numbers. I don't know why I'm, I'm, I'm seeing like a pin, like somebody try to put in a pin to like a um like you know how when you go to the gas station and you got to put the pin in for your card oh look i ain't trying to say no nobody's pins to their names close my door please and thank you i didn't open that close it be careful y'all i'm sorry five 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 on the clock i'm not trying to tell y'all pin numbers to y'all cards okay if that is, change it. Okay, if somebody knows the pin to your cards, change that shit. Yeah, family room. Change it. Concern. Expectation when it comes to this child. What is this lover situation here? What is this lover situation here? We got distant horizon and change. Okay, so you're about to get a change in... Okay, so somebody who tried to steal something from you, steal this love connection from you, yeah, you about to get it right back. Yeah, with distant horizon and change. That's what I'm getting from this. Okay, I'm also hearing, too, that the dates that I said could be people's... Um, could be the dates of the people who were involved in taking this love situation away and stealing this love connection. There is two doves here. So the divine is watching over this love connection. It will come through no matter what is what I'm hearing. So we have 912, 914, 97, 927. Um, this is September, okay? Or it could be times as well so we got september 12th september 14th september 27th september 7th september 24th september 15th september 3rd september 5th september 6th then we have september 7th september 2nd september 4th september 5th as well so this could be happening, yeah, 30. This could be happening this month. 9.30, you could hear somebody about somebody being in court. Yeah, a main male who was now about to be in poverty and in bad health. Someone's going to prison because of this false person. Or this false person is about to go in prison. Yeah, because they did something over a house. Yeah, you about to get unexpected income when it comes to your occupation. With this main female towards this great fortune. Was, okay, so somebody may come in and try to marry you. These people have lost their mind. <laughs> Something is backfiring. These people are about to lose their minds on September 30th. Okay? So this could, yeah, poverty. Nine three seven so nine thirty seven p.m a.m could be significant as well we got 35 36 37 okay so something okay so this is about to lead up to what is about to happen somebody try to may may try to take you to court or you may have to go to court because of these people or some i'm hearing somebody try to take you to court and it didn't work yep great fortune Yep, May Mill. Okay. Okay, so I feel like this could be a battle. And probably a child support battle. Somebody tried to get somebody sick and in jail, this false person. Yeah, because of a house, they no longer wanted to be with them anymore. And they got, the May Mill got unexpected income when it comes to their occupation. 
and there's another main female that is also going to take somebody to court yeah over this courtship with this community over this gift okay so it sounds like a main main male wants to go towards a privileged lady or something like that number one could be significant so january 12th could be significant january 14th um Ooh, I'm getting the feeling that somebody's in. Somebody got some shit going on. A main male has, has some stuff going on. Or is about to find out about all the shit that, that went on. Let me look. Divine Feminine, this could be your masculine that, that is going through this. at this time okay so i'm about to end this because it's already an hour um yeah love affair um what uh, skylar i just bought you your kitchen i'm not buying anything else close no. my door no save your money i don't want it save your money that is for you I will buy you what you want. You save your money. I bought you a kitchen. That is enough for this month. You got your one gift for this month. You will get something else next month. But if I win, I can buy something. No, because I can't stick $2 on my card. Do you understand that that $2 is going to get spent before? That's, that's the fee to put money on my card. Close my door all the way. So somebody is in authority. Somebody's trying to also challenge somebody author somebody's authority. Yeah, you could be about to step into some type of authority and there's going to be fast changes. The divine is speeding something up. Okay, so what's coming in for the collective when it comes to this love affair? I just saw love affair again. What's coming in for the collective? Whether it be love, finances, because we got unexpected income and great fortune here. Somebody could have a choice between lovers as well as what I heard. Somebody could also maybe um, thinking about changing directions and like moving, getting an apartment or something. They may ask you to move in with them. Yeah, I ain't y'all are not about to get me to start singing today, 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 today. No, no, no. Okay, what's coming in for the collective Holy Spirit? What's coming in for the collective? Three cards. One more card, please. Thank you. Transformation. Okay, so there's somebody is not being afraid of the yeah, somebody could want to invest in you because they saw your transformation. They see how far you've come. Direction. Yeah, plan where you want to be. So somebody is planning. They're they're making some type of action. They felt like they went through, they they made a wrong decision to begin with. And they want to come. They want to I'm I'm here and I'm about to do a UE. So somebody be careful if y'all doing UEs, U turns in the middle of the fucking street. Be careful, okay? Plan where you want to be, okay? Do not deviate from your path attract a mentor if necessary okay so you could have made a decision to continue to be on your path um reckless behavior can lead to bad consequences think before you act okay so you realize okay so somebody could have went in a direction and now they realize that it was the wrong decision to make but it was needed for this transformation so transformation changes is change is the natural order of things don't be afraid of the unknown Okay, so people may not like your transformation. 
there could be also a main male that likes that doesn't like your transformation but likes your transformation they feel like you could have made a wrong move or a wrong decision um and they're trying to somebody could be trying to come back around to steer your direction okay keep forward on the direction that you chose i'm hearing it. they gotta come to me they can't come to you okay so your ancestors are telling you that they have to come to you yeah in focus this week's winners and losers okay so the divine is forcing these main males and your masculines to come to to come to you. You cannot go to them anymore. They have to come to you. I'm hearing step up or step down. Okay, so maybe they want to step step they doing some stepping. What's this wrong move? We got power here. Bright ideas, star power. So you're standing in your power at this time. Your complete star power. Yeah, look at look at you, collective. Look at you, bad ass on your throne. You focusing on your needs at this time. You have the power to take control of your life, career, and finances. Yeah, this is the direction that you took. Yeah. And then with the wrong decisions, we got bright ideas. Having innovation, new inspiration test new ideas and break out fast take action on your ideas they feel your divine masculines feel that since you went in this direction it wasn't the right it was the wrong decision because now you're building a foundation for yourself you're you're too you're too in your power and they feel like it was a wrong decision but in reality, it was the correct decision for you to make to bring on this transformation because now here you are, star power, become an influencer of the company and earn fame, popularity, step into the spotlight. So you've transformed and you chose to step into your power and step into the spotlight or this is what you are about to do. So you're focusing on your needs and your needs only. You're not putting in or the divine is saying you need to stop putting in so much effort when it comes to, okay. So I tell my daughter all the time, boys get you in trouble. Boys will get you in trouble. I'm 30 years old, two kids, and no husband next to me. Like, they'll get you in trouble. Like, my life is a fucking movie. Like, I can literally write my movie, write, like, write my life out and turn it into a movie and I bet you I'd make millions off of that bitch. I will make millions off of my life. And a lot of us spiritualists, we definitely, we would. We honestly would. But I feel like at this moment, like, a lot of divine masculines can't come towards us divine feminines because they have not did in the work. They have made a lot of bad decisions when it comes to these third parties or stringing us along or anything else like that. So why not step into our power? Why not? Like, come on. <laughs> like, okay. So either you step up or you step the fuck down. Step back so then another person, another main male who is in their power and get into, you know, the right direction and already has transformed into their higher self comes in and meets us i'm hearing they're afraid they don't they they can't they don't know how to do it so now they have to watch you build your own foundation but they can't come on and hop on the bandwagon because they gonna be the little the um my daddy calls them bagineers <laughs> bagineers bagineers Bagineers, his definition is is the the people that want to come and ride the tote the tote the your tote no your coattail from when your foundation is already built and you like doing good and you you making money moves you in your power you know you on your grind you in your CEO mindset and then they want to come in and hop on your bandwagon to get your siphoning siphoning your um abundance but they don't want to put in the work 
that is the that is the definition my daddy <laughs> my daddy has given me when it comes to the bagineers okay yeah All they want to do is ride a tuck cat that's a coat tail, but don't want to put in the work. They don't they don't want to do the work. They don't want to help build the foundation. They want to break you down to build it back up. Like, where the hell they do it? That at? You got your foundation. I got my foundation. Let's put our foundation together and see what the hell could make. Period. One plus one is three, baby. The fuck? <laughs> the Holy Trinity. <laughs> Come on now. A main male, a main female, up here, is our dreams, our destiny, where we both, but they don't want to do that. If you already working with the divine, you, the divine, and the Holy Spirit, boom, okay? They want to try to break that. So they could come in and try. Nah, we ain't doing all that. One eleven on the clock. We ain't doing all that. We ain't doing all that. Not at all. And I feel like this, that's for a lot of us divine feminines out here. One eleven, eleven on the clock as I look down. Yeah, us, us divine feminines ain't doing all that. Why, why tear a woman down? Because you insecure because you haven't made shit in your life? And you ain't going after your drive? You lost hope because we ain't fucking with you no more. Let's just be honest. Because you did not want to do... You, you didn't want to do the work. You didn't want to raise your vibration. You wanted to sit around, smoke pot, do all these other drugs. Hang around with hoes and bitches and your friends. And and uh, watching whatever you want to watch on TV and shit like that. But you didn't want to put in the work. And you wonder why these women are so disrespectful to these men. Yeah. What you think? But at the same time, y'all men have been disrespectful to us divine feminines. And e even with the karmic feminines, 12, 12 on the clock, y'all been disrespectful to us women. Highly disrespectful because y'all think y'all got a D and y'all run shit. Y'all don't run anything, baby. Y'all the ones... They came out of us. Or did we forget? We, as women, created you men. Men don't carry any children for nine months. We are creation. But y'all want to tear us women down. So y'all can create the life that y'all want to have. Y'all, uh, multi-women relationships where you want to have this woman doing the cooking and cleaning and this woman rubbing your feet and your back and then this one cleaning your clothes and all this other shit as sisterhood. Fuck all that. And I'm going to speak on that. Fuck all that. And then you wonder why women are, are, are juggling between two to three men. Because we see our leaders do it when it comes to two to three women but at the same time y'all are doing it all wrong all wrong i'm hearing that beyonce song we run the world girls we run the world girls yeah we let y'all have y'all y'all three minutes of fame but guess what in reality if it wasn't for us women, y'all wouldn't be here. Now they showing me Mary. Mary was a virgin when she when she gave birth to Jesus. When she got impregnated. Yeah. We don't need y'all see. If we really wanted to, we could manifest the baby inside of us. We are creation. 1414 14 on the clock. Don't forget where you come from. Inside of a woman, bro. And I'm speaking on this because I think it is filthy, filthy how our men think that they can downgrade us women.
Because at the end of the day, all y'all have to do is, is, is take out the trash and go to work. Oh, if we really want to make a list of who really does what in a relationship and in the household, the feminine energy does a hell of a lot more than a man and a masculine energy. I could tell you that. And I stand on that. I stand on it. Ten toes down. I'll even put my hands on it. Period. Period. And I know I'm speaking the truth. So females out there. And I know I have more men that watch me than females. But guess what? If y'all mad men, masculines, who think they run anything, Drop in the comments. I want to know y'all. I want to know y'all concerns and y'all argument on this. 51, 1551. Y'all don't have to spend 18 to 24 hours bearing a children. Bearing our children. On top of that, caring. Carrying our children for up to nine months. I've watched videos of men who they put those um, those machines on their stomach when it comes to the um, the contraction, the contraction monitor thing, so they can feel what it feels like for a woman to have a contraction. Y'all can't handle shit. The pain y'all think y'all go through, y'all ain't going through nothing. We deal with all your anger issues, all your insecurities from your mama and your daddy issues and how controlling y'all are and all this other stuff. But no one wants to step up to the plate. But then when the relationship goes bad, it's the woman's fault. Because what did we do to make the man act like that? Hmm? Hmm. But in reality, isn't the man supposed to be the leader? So if the man is the leader and the woman is acting out, what the fuck are you doing, bro? Let's be honest. Oh. Oh. Let's be honest. Hmm? Since you're supposed to be a leader. No accountability is taken by these men. They do not care about. And I'm not talking. Okay. Because I hear the ones in the background talk about. You know what you talk about. I take accountability. Okay. So the ones who are actually men out there. Who do take accountability for their actions. And do apologize to their women for their actions that they made in a relationship. And why the situation is fucked up the way it is. I'm not talking to y'all. 18, 18 on the clock. I'm talking to the ones in the back back that ride the small bus. What did y'all do to get your woman? Because it's the most high, the man, the woman, then the children. You are the leader. You are the head of the household. What are y'all not doing? But it's always falling up on the women. Always falling up on the women. <sighs> I'm going to let that sit there. I don't. <laughs> I do know why. I do know why the divine wanted this to come out. I wanted it to come out. Because it's, it's, it's a question on a lot of us women's minds. 1919 on the clock. When is it the time for our men to take accountability? Instead of knocking a woman down so y'all could rebuild 
When do y'all take accountability for y'all actions? When do y'all start doing the work and going through the self-healing process and the dark night of the soul and dealing with the issues that y'all have at hand and dealing with your shadow side? When is it time? Because instead of y'all dealing with it, y'all would rather go and mess with another man who also has issues. Sign of synchronicity. My dog is barking. Y'all want to be around y'all homeboys and y'all thinking y'all cool and everything like that. But I could tell you nine times out of ten, none of y'all are fucking married. None of y'all have a issue. None of y'all have a, a correct relationship and a healthy relationship with your women. Y'all are all fighting and arguing. I wonder why. You sit there with your boys and y'all want to play board games and video games and all this other shit. <laughs> huh? Can you answer me that? But yet the women are looked at as hoes and all this other stuff because there is a nice, fine man that wants to come in and sweep us up right off of our feet. The moment they see us, because they recognize by the energy of how the woman upholds herself. I'm going to let y'all think about that. 21, 21 on the clock. I'm going to go ahead and leave it here. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. I love y'all collected to the bottom of my heart. To the soles of my feet, to the top of my head, <laughs> to around in these streets. <laughs> I don't know why I said that, but oh my gosh. Okay, I'm over here making a whole mixtape. <laughs> I'm making a mixtape. Okay, so, so that could be significant for somebody. Somebody might be making a mixtape. I don't know. Kudos to you. Send email it to me so I can listen to it. All right. But. I hope y'all take that into account. The women and the men, masculine and females, whoever watched this video. Because I've been wondering, I know I'm not perfect. And I'm not saying I, I, I'm not perfect by a million, 22, 22. But I understand growth and I understand transformation. So every day I try to be better than I was yesterday. I'm trying to be better, better than I was five minutes ago. But where does where does accountability come in at? I'm going to leave that there. Okay? I love y'all. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe if you have not already. Share this video. Share, share, share. Uh, masculine and feminine. If y'all if got this question going on in y'all little circles and stuff like that, yeah, share it to your friend. And then drop in the comments. So we can have a conversation on this because it is been it's been in my head for a while. And I just want to know. I, I want to know where y'all mind is at when it comes to this. And how 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 are we gonna what are we gonna do as a whole collective to help change this situation when it comes to 2332? When it comes to not only the men taking accountability, but also the women taking accountability. Because there are some women out here that do not take accountability. And there are some men out here that do take, that doesn't either. Or that do, you know, vice versa, whatever. I'm not talking to people as a whole. And I'm not trying to point anybody out or anything like that. Where does the growth come in at? Where does the dark night of the soul, where does the healing come from? When do we start that? What stage in our life do we have to go through? How can we make a change for the better, for the collective? On this. Just like Diddy sitting in prison right now. Because now he has to take accountability for how many booties he done, he done got into. That's a whole nother topic. The file with the, with the, the <laughs> how that's fucking crazy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so what I just said with the booty fruity tooties, 
<laughs> we got the Fruit Loop. Dang. Okay, the new Fruit Loop commercial, 444 on the clock. Okay. You know how it's Fruity Pebbles? I mean, um, uh, not Fruity Pebbles. So, Fruity Pebbles could be significant. Fruit Loops. You know how they're different colors, but they got the holes in them? Why do you think they had the Fruit Loops with the bird singing? Then they drop it down into the piano. And then when he takes a spoon to get him all out to eat him, the piano falls. The fall of the music industry. Sign and synchronicities are everywhere. 25, 25 on the clock. <clears throat> all right, y'all. I'm going to leave it there. My vent time is over. <laughs> I hope y'all have a beautiful Sunday evening. And what are you doing? I'm grabbing some. Grabbing what? This. What is that? I'm drawing a picture of pink. Ooh, don't get it everywhere. Not. And you about to be going to bed here soon. Yep, it's 740. You got 20 minutes. Okay. Close my door. Thank you. Okay, who when the wind started blowing. I hope y'all have an amazing Sunday evening. Um, I love y'all. I love y'all. I love y'all. I love y'all. Please do not forget to drop down. Let's have a conversation about it. I, I just want to know everyone's opinions, okay? Um, and if I'm not understanding something, like, don't correct me, but help help me to understand a little bit better. That's that's what I want. Actually, no. You could correct me if you feel like you need to. But at the end of the day, if you're going to show any type of negative energy or anything like that, just know you will be blocked. Okay? I'm going to put that out there right now. Because I ain't got no time for no negative energy or anything like that. I just want to have a simple conversation about accountability. Okay? When it comes to the men and when it comes to the women. When does this start? And what could we do as a collective to help bring these people accountable when it comes to when it comes their time? OK, because it's time to pay up. Kermit's got to repay all. OK, I'm going to just leave that there. All right. I love y'all.